Hi everyone! Today we will be coloring Nightfall by Maria Trolle and this video is for Fernanda. I apologize for the quality because both my video camera and my photo camera do crazy things with such contrasted picture. I selected this one only because I really love lilies, especially this variety with orange petals and brown spots. Maybe they are like wild lilies, but I do love whites also, but orange lilies are my favorites. That was my starting point to choose this picture, and when I started it, I didn't have any ideas about how I want to finished picture look and how which colors I want to use, but in the process I decided that maybe this picture will be helpful for beginner colorists, so I did three parts video. For the lily petals I choose orange as a basic color and I will be using it on the outer part of each petal, but I will vary pressure. In the middle of the petal I will, do, will be doing a lighter area because it gets more of the sunlight and in the middle it's almost transparent. And on the tip of the petal and on the bottom part I will press harder and I do more deep orange. Next. I will add terracotta to the bottom part and to the stamens also, and then yellowed orange to the inner part of the petal. I colored all lilies in the same way, in the same color, because on this picture we have a lot of details of various plants and leaves and we need to find a way how to get a well-balanced page where all small details are parts of the whole. That's why I will try to minimize amount of colors I use and I also will be repeating the same colors for the various parts of the picture. So, when you will finish this first part, don't put away your orange, yellow and green colors which we use here, we will be needing them in the next part. When I color even not very realistic leaves, I always tend to use three or at least two colors. So for the lilies leaves I selected dark green as a main color, but it's not my favorite pencil. I always love to smooth its brightness, excessive brightness, in my opinion, with some other lighter pencil. And today I will be using cream as a second pencil and I also will be doing highlighted area in the middle of the, each leaf. You can also use your cream pencil to smooth area in the middle of orange petal and to make a smooth transition between orange and white highlighted area. I will be using a lot of this cream pencil on the page and it will help me to unite all details of the picture and also it will help to create effect of the a very soft warm sunlight both on the girl and on the plants. You will see that I will be using cream also for the second row of leaves together with Prussian green and sap green light and also cream will go to the inner part of the five petal small flowers. I hope that it was helpful and that you will join me in the second part.